There it goes again, that same robust dream, and yet here I stand. Loss of a Lindsay Farron, a 20-year-old, let down on my parents' expectations. I was never a believer of ghosts or apparitions. Heck, even little me knew Santa Claus was a made-up myth after witnessing my father trip down the stairs carrying my limited edition Barbie. But if there is one thing I learned in my sad void of a life, is that some things don't always seem the way that they are. We have a situation of your body on East Boulevard Street. Need officers in the area immediately. Roger that. Over. Oh dear God. What is that? Fred, pull yourself together, soldier. You're right, my bad. We must report this one the truth. I don't know what kind of sicko it would take to do such a thing like this. But whoever it is, they're out for blood. The dance floor, don't work too hard, my break a backbone. Return of the Mac, the king is back though. Cove and the cash, I never like those. Ah, uh, what do you want, Jerome? Wow, such an attitude. Anyways, Lindsay, you down to like party tonight or what? Ooh, party. Where at? Hosting the party at the beach house tonight. Parents are off onto some weird business trip, so all of this is left to cool old Jerome. I guess I could use the funds since these studies have been kicking my butt recently. Well, for real, if you're down to the party, the party starts around 8 o'clock tonight, so don't be late and bring some treats. I also may have invited a few more friends that you may know of. Sounds good. See you at the party. Laters. <laughs> What the heck did I just hit? A deer? Wait, what? That's a little child! No, I'm out, bro! Not today! Can't believe I hit a baby out there today, bro. They really need signs out there. Like, come on, who's gonna know when a baby is on the road? Like, dude, at least a crosswalker or something. Yo, Jerome, what's kicking, man? So, man, nothing much. What's all that noise in the background? Just treading some gnarly waves, man. You still up for watching the new episode of Love or Die? Yeah, man, show is airing soon. I'll just be waiting. Come over anytime. All right, man. Later, dude. Yo, Jerome, I'm here. Bro is probably dropping a fat log. I'm just gonna walk in. Hey, yo, Jerome. Can I finish this sandwich on the floor? Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, man, dig in. Do you know think Guillermo will die? I don't know, man. Let's turn it on and find out. Another body found this morning. Investigators think it may link to the recent killings. Previously on Love or Die. Oh, Guillermo, sweetheart. No, Barbara, please give me another chance. Let me be the man of your dreams. I can make you happier than ever. Oh, my sweet Gamble. I am so flattered, but I am in love with Barbara. Wow, I did not expect that. Poor Guillermo, all heartbroken. I knew that Barbara was up to no good. <laughs> Are you crying? <laughs> no, I'm not, man. It's a, it's a salt from the beach. Anyways, man, I gotta go to work. Alright, brother. Party at 8 o'clock at my house, by the way. Gonna be playing games and eating food. Sick, dude. I'll be there. Welcome to McDingo. What do you want? Um, can I get a, um... Um, I'll have a... Sir, do we, we do not have all day. Um, excuse me? Who do you think you're talking to, little man? The freak you call me little man for? Excuse me. I think you don't know who you are talking to. Shut your mouth, tiny guy. Look like Martha Stewart if she's on Titanic. That's not how you talk to your elders. Now go and fix me a sandwich. <gasps> you me a sandwich. I'll be fixing you. Big boy is a knuckle to the cranium. I don't really put enough for this. Ooh, I love this party. Hey, girls, what's poppin'? Are you two a bunch of trash bags? Cause I'd love to take you out. 
Um, excuse me, ew, what a weirdo. So, Lindsay, where have you been lately? You've been showing up to school for so long. Is everything okay? Nope, same old Lindsay. Boring life and unmotivated like normal. Just a pocket full of sunshine, yay. Thanks for hosting the party, Jerome. Been a while since we all kicked back and got together. Yeah, of course. Gotta love these tiny escapes from all the stress every once in a while. Well, I'm glad to see you around at least. Not the same without you, Lindsay. So did you guys hear? Hear what? Oh, you didn't hear? There's some psycho killer that is going around. Wait, like Frosted Flakes? Nah, dummy. Not that kind of cereal. You're lucky we're your friends, or else you'd get lost on a one-way street like your buddy Hunter over there. Mm -hmm. Wait, there's a killer within the area? Wow, that makes my skin crawl. Yeah, and their latest victim has barely even a mile within this place. Yeah, I don't mess around with that stuff, but we don't got anything to worry about. I'm sure the local sheriffs Rich and Fred got that taken care of. Those guys are the best. Sure, coming from the cops who don't even know the difference between their right and left handcuff. So, you like to serve? Nah. That's not really my thing. Oh. Yo, punk. Huh? Party late, man. Can't even get the food around here. Yeah, alone ladies. Yeah, well, not everyone has the privilege of having a multi-million dollar father who invented self-cleaning underwear grow up. Sure, pal, and I bet you're wearing them right now. So what if I am? They're comfy, yet breathable. Get out, bro. Fine, I was just about to leave it anyways. This party sucks. What a letdown. Well, at least I got a Bugatti. Can't believe those fools were so mean to me. I was just trying to make some friends. Like, who wouldn't want to be friends with a rich guy like myself? What? No! No, no, no! You stupid piece of crap. I told my dad not to give me the orange one. Blue wouldn't have broke down. Guess I'll check the hood. Man, it's dark outside. Alright, let's pop this bad boy open. Uh oh, that doesn't look good. Guess I'll go check if there's a shop around. Dang, it's dark. Wow, been walking for quite a while, huh? What is that? Is that a head? One, what is your emergency? There's a body in the woods! Send help now! East Boulevard! Officer Rich, emergency at East Boulevard again. Report for no man in distress. Get going now! Roger that. Alright, sir, try not to panic. We have officers on the way. Sit still and try not to go outside. My God, I'm already outside! Oh, please get your fast. What is that? Give oh. <laughs> me! No! 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 <laughs> Looks like a car broke down here. Should've got it in blue. And it wouldn't have broke down. Oh, um, brother, I don't know if it works like that. Hey, Rick, I found something over here. Looks like a bloody handprint. Good eye, Fred. Let's keep looking for clues. Hey, there is a blood trail leading this way. Oh, Lord. What on God's green earth is that? No, I'm gonna be sick. Not this again. Yeah, another young one down the drain. It wasn't his time, man. <laughs> it wasn't. <laughs> It's time. Hey in there, Fred. We will get to the bottom of this. Oh, he left his phone here. Maybe we can trace his contacts back at headquarters. Who is knocking at this hour? People just never let me sleep, do they? Hey there, Jerome. Reports from a kid named Sean was here today. Does that ring a bell? Uh, Sean? I don't know, Sean. Rich kid, how strong? Does that help you? Oh, that guy. Oh yeah, he left uh, ages ago. What's the issue? Well, you might want to take a look at this. Huh? Missing? What happened? If only he was actually missing, this man was slaughtered right here, in this very town. What? We really went for questioning soon, but all I can say is lock your doors and don't trust anyone. Yes sir, thank you for informing me. So why did you guys want to talk to me again in my million dollar mansion? It's about your son. What did he do again? Did he crash his car or break anything? If so, I can pay that up right away. No sir. I'm sorry to tell you this, but your son, he has been murdered. <gasps> hey Lindsay, I got some insane news. The cops just stopped at my house because of something crazy. Remember that rich jerk from the party earlier who left? Oh, are you talking about that one kid? I think his name is Sean. Yeah, well, Sean, he's dead. <laughs>